With so many things to do in Africa, a gorilla trekking experience stands out as one of Africa's top tourist attractions. For those who have never been on a gorilla trek before, it can be easy to feel overwhelmed and confused about what to expect and how to prepare for the experience. For this reason, we're going to dive into a brief overview of what gorilla trekking is all about and everything you need to know before embarking on this adventure. Gorilla trekking entails taking a guided hike through dense rainforests in order to spend time with a specific gorilla troop in their natural habitat. This activity allows visitors to understand the enduring fascination with these human-like creatures, while also making a significant difference in their conservation and well-being. Mountain gorillas can only be found in the Virunga Massif, a volcanic mountain range that runs through Rwanda, the Democratic Republic of the Congo, and Uganda. Uganda is our number one choice for visitors looking to go on a gorilla trekking expedition because its cost for gorilla permits is less costly compared to Rwanda. The Democratic Republic of the Congo, on the other hand, lacks proper security for gorilla trekking. That being said, Bwindi Impenetrable National Park and Mokohinga National Park are the only two parks in Uganda that are home to mountain gorillas. Bwindi has far more gorillas than Mokohinga with an estimated population of over 500 mountain gorillas. It is possible to go on a gorilla trekking tour all year round, but you will most likely encounter a lot of rain during certain times of the year. The high season, which is the best time to visit, runs from June to September and December to February. These are the two times of the year when Uganda receives the least amount of rain. Yes, a gorilla permit is required before visiting either Bwindi or Mugahinga. These permits help fund gorilla conservation efforts while also limiting the number of visitors within the parks. Too many visitors would be detrimental to the gorilla's way of life. The funds received from the trekkers' permits are also used to fund local communities' projects. A permit for gorilla trekking in Uganda's Bwindi Impenetrable National Park or Mugahinga National Park costs $700 per person, which is less expensive when compared to Rwanda's Volcanoes National Park, which cost $1,500 per person. Before going for your gorilla trekking expedition, it's important to pack the right gear to ensure that you get to enjoy your jungle walk in time with the gorilla. A camera, insect repellent, a strong pair of gloves, a walking stick, and a day pack or rucksack are some of the items that you should bring for your expedition. As with any trek or safari, there is an acceptance that nothing is guaranteed. Having said that, we've always seen gorillas on our treks and have never heard of a group missing out. Before beginning any gorilla trekking expedition, the park staff normally dispatches several trackers ahead with the intention of communicating with your guide via radio and GPS on the right track to see gorillas once they encounter them. So, the chances of you spotting gorillas in the wild are pretty high. Mm -hmm. 
The maximum number of visitors per day for each guerrilla trekking troop, whether in Rwanda or Uganda, is eight, and this excludes the trek guides. Each trekking group is assigned a specific troop of guerrillas to visit. Visitors are also only allowed to spend one hour with the troop once they arrive. This time limit is in place to minimize your impact on the primates. There are numerous tour companies that offer guerrilla trekking trips to Uganda or Rwanda, but choosing the right tour operator to work with can be extremely difficult. We recommend going with a fun, responsible, and personable operator that promotes the local communities, and that's what we do best. If you need to plan your guerrilla trekking experience or need help in planning your trip to Africa, Click our inquiry link below in our description and we'll be more than happy to help you. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.